However, my marriage was more a convenient union the life is that despite my deep knowledge and analysis of power, I never managed to reach a position of great authority in Florence. I was imprisoned and tortured after being falsely accused of conspiracy, and I spent the rest of my life in exile, far from active politics. The death came in 1527, under relatively common... I died from an illness, possibly a complication of a kidney condition, in my home on the outskirts of Florence. I was imprisoned, tortured, and finally exiled from my beloved Florence. My contributions to political thought have transcended my time and have left an indelible mark on history. My life is a testament to the complexity and often the cruelty of power, but also to resilience. Despite the challenges and tragedies I faced, my work remains alive, 